Right, you guys, so I got these white shelves at Walmart and they are $19 each, basically like, you know, like around almost like $20, not that bad. So it comes in three drawers and then I chose the shade white because I felt like, you know, it's a little less tacky. Now, I just want to let you guys know that these type of drawers are not something that you should like put in like heavy stuff. Um, I haven't really measured it really in my cabinet. This is something that I purchased and not meant to be displayed outside where I can physically see it. So I thought it would be nice to put it in the tiny closet to maximize the space instead of using the clothing rack because I felt like the clothing rack is gonna really give up on its life. So let's go ahead and clear out my closet. I will show you guys what it looks like because it is absolutely nuts. This actually comes with wheels, but we're not gonna use that since it's going to be stuck in just one place. And also the reason why I chose this is because if I don't want it anymore, I can just literally just throw them or give them away. Very easy to dispose. So yeah, let me zoom you guys in so you guys could see the measurement, the brand and everything. Go ahead and screenshot that if you are interested at the end of this video. Right. Who is ready to see the messy closet? Um, please don't judge me. I have been working nonstop and usually my days off. I just prefer to just lay around even if I don't want to. It's just like my body kind of chooses it to be that way. So this is my closet now. I know. Shh. Stop. And then I tried putting on clothes in the, the rack over there, but um, it's not good. It's about to like fall apart, break down in something. So, whoop. <laughs> this is the chaos this is what we are going to fix so hopefully the reason why i grabbed uh, four of them is because two of each stacked and hopefully they fit perfectly so let's put it to the test what i'm going to do is that i'm going to take everything out okay i'm in the transition of decluttering and replacing all of the clothes that i have been wearing for so many years anything that reminded me of the past i am taking them all out I am reinventing myself completely, entirely. I changed the way I look. I changed the way I, I wore my makeup. And it's just, I just love how it feels right now. So let's go ahead and start. I'm going to start with these ones because um, I kind of like a lot that in there. Whoop. <laughs> oh, this is horrible. Bad, bad, bad. You know what's fun, you guys, after this whole entire one-year transition of me from being, you know, in a relationship for six years, seven years or whatnot, um, I, I've just, everything just changed, like my point of view in life, and I feel like I'm at peace all the time, and it's just been so wonderful because it's just, you know, I can do whatever I want without telling me, like, no, and... You know, it's nice because I don't need to address to anyone. I feel free. I feel very free and I feel very happy. And it's quite rebellious, you know. Even though this apartment is um, obviously it's quite expensive. It is definitely higher than my three bedroom mortgage. But let me tell you, even though I'm on a crunch with most of all aspects in my life right now, I feel like this is the best decision that I have ever made in my life because I have, you know, peace of mind. And let me tell you, like the mental stability and emotional stability is the best thing that I have given myself. And I, I really can't thank God enough for allowing me to have this wonderful space that I can call my own. Um, I do had to downgrade a lot, like a lot, a lot, but at the same time, again, like, I'm just happy that, you know, I'd rather have it this way. Holy crap, you guys. Ridiculous. All right, now it's for the moment of truth. Will it fit? Hope so. Okay. One of them fit. <laughs> I have a good feeling about this, you guys, because I didn't really measure it. I just eyeballed it because 
I don't have the measuring tape. Like if I need it, I can't find it. So let's grab a couple of more. Oh my gosh. No freaking way. I am so happy. I actually think that I can fit one more there. But I don't think it will fit something like, you know, like a regular cabinet that they have. Because this one, wow, I'm the queen of eyeballing. I'm so glad that there's like enough space right over here, guys. So actually in the middle, you know what I can put in there is like a, like a skinny little rack. Or like the shoe boxes, like the very important ones that I have. Though I don't really spend a lot when it comes to shoes because I love fast fashion. I think it's a sickness of mine that I have. If I have worn the outfit like so many times, I'm like, ugh. It's like I don't want it anymore. But I'm so, 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 so happy that this fit perfectly. And it's actually just right even if there's a space here. Because when I open this... See, when I open that, I don't have to like scoot in there. It's, you know, this has space to really, you know, fully open. So let me grab the rest. I also want to kind of take this out because I don't like how that looks. And I'm going to try this as careful as I can so that there is no residue. I just feel like it's more cleaner and more classy without it. I mean, it's plastic, but I like it to be as presentable as it could be and that is awesome like look at all of that storage you guys and it just looks nice and it's gonna even look even uh nicer when Ooh, why can i not talk <laughs> it's gonna look even better once i put the clothes inside you know in a very organized way so common sense you guys we already know that this is kind of flimsy so you're gonna put the heaviest clothes at the bottom to lightest because if you put something heavy at the top or the midsection you may not be able to open the compartments in between it's going to be sandwiched if that makes any sense at all so let's take out the wheels and set it aside for future use i already know that i'm going to be moving in the future so i told myself like maybe you know in the future this is something that i can put in the garage or who knows? I mean, it's not really that bad. You know, it's not a horrible life, but <laughs> I like it. I think it's really nice and functional and it's not the cutest thing in the entire world, but hey, you know? So let's start putting things inside. I need to take these off too. The other ones I've just did it on cam. By the way, you're probably wondering like, damn, what happened to our channel? I know I used to have like a lot of views back then and now, you know not anymore but it's okay you know like the purpose of my channel is to really just have fun and share the things that i really really like and you know whoever wants to watch I feel like all of us have grown in a in a different way like i also came to a point that i felt like somehow i got really exhausted when it comes to makeup because of like the releases almost every month is just a little too overwhelming and i i don't like you know, like, I feel like my makeup right now just turned out to be, like, just very much neutrals and, you know, I'm all about skincare. I mean, ever since I was 18, 15, I'm all about skincare. So now that I am more mature, that's what I have been focusing on more. Yay! Cute. So my advice, if you guys are filling it in, the bins in, take them out go sit in a couch or something while watching tv so that way you don't feel like oh you know i mean you're still concentrated like doing you know folding your clothes and things like that but so that you don't feel like a little overwhelmed so i'm gonna take this one put in my black leggings my work clothes and then i'll be right back so these are my leggings by the way guys i do have a ton of leggings and you can roll them if you wanted to, to maximize space, or you can just leave it just like that. So maybe I'll just leave it like that because I just want to leave it like that. No, um, I just want to finish early, okay? Like, I have a life to live. <laughs> I have somewhere to be, and I just really want to share this with you guys. Also, I really miss you guys. That's also the reason why. <laughs> so I just want to give you guys, like, a little life update, too, because 
I just want you guys to know that I'm alive. You guys, look at my first drawer. This looks so, so, so satisfying. Now, because this is a little heavy, it is gonna go at the very, very bottom. So this one drawer alone, um, it fit almost like 25 leggings and then maybe like around 15 to 20 sports bras. Very nice. Hello everyone. So this is the progress. Funny that I say that because I felt like I didn't even start it yet. So most of the bins are already filled and I'm so excited for the outcome of this tiny little project of mine. So it's so hard to keep everything organized if they're slipping and sliding. So are you guys ready for the grand reveal? Me too. I worked for like three and a half hours for this. Ta-da! You're probably like, ew, it looks like garbage. <laughs> like, oh. All right, so this is what it looks like. I am so happy, obviously, what, whatever is in there. Like, I literally tried my best to keep them nice and organized. I promise you they are folded, okay? Like, calm down, all right? Like, calm down. It doesn't look aesthetically pleasing, but most of them are silk and satin. That's why they're just, like, slipping everywhere. But maybe if I had, like, those dividers, you know, it would have been even better. But it's not something that I want to invest in right now. So I'm actually happy because I was thinking like, man, I'm going to have a hard time like opening these shelves because, you know, um, oops, I said like, oh, it's folded and then I open it. It looks like garbage. But yeah, and like my house, lounge clothes, clothes for work, obviously, it's like entirely black. So overall with these um, drawers for $19. I could say that it is not bad at all quality. I'm so surprised. I thought it's going to be like frimsy and it'll crack and break apart. But again, still be very careful with that because you will never know, right? But for a temporary situation fix, I think it is good. I think it really is effective and it doesn't even cost that much, not even $100. So I'm very pretty happy with that. So overall, I would like to say that I am satisfied with these drawers. Um, they are affordable, they are functional, and yes, they do open even if you have a lot of things inside. But of course, don't try not to overfill them because you're going to have a hard time like pulling them out, obviously. But even with a little bit of weight, I'm so shocked that they, you know, they can still open on their own. So... I'm glad and it's such a nice, affordable, easy fix for your closet. Um, this way, I definitely stored a lot of things and I'm so, so, so happy about that. Like in the middle, um, I'm just going to go ahead and put some shoe boxes and put more stuff in there. Uh, usually, I don't really put shoes inside my bedroom because I find it like so unsanitary, even if it's like, uh, you know, expensive ones. But I don't really have expensive shoes because I just wear them out and like, you know, I get tired of them and then that's it. But let me just show you guys some of the stuff right over here. My onesies, my onesies, my rompers, shirts, dresses. So that's pretty much it for today, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, like I do recommend these for an easy fix. You know, it is something that is so affordable and effective and I enjoy doing this. So Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.